Hello and uh, welcome to a quick show and uh, presentation on our uh, deep funding or for our Indonesia, um, Japan and Vietnam communities. So first, um, what we're doing um, is the proposal we focus and we hope that we can grow in similar fashion as the Project Catholic that we grow from five proposal to 117 proposal and fountain for Project Catholic in, in Japan, Vietnam and Indonesia for last 24 months. So since September. Um, so I believe that uh, the proposal, if you're keen to read on our proposal, um, the URL on the website, that pretty much, uh, who are we? So the, with the, the aim is we try to focus on community, not just education. Uh, apart from we work at a university, most of us, myself, is yes, doctor in information, which is where mostly I don't share too much about that because we do in cybersecurity. So we try to hidden ourselves as much as we can <laughs> before we surfer on the, on the net. So at the end of the day that we think, okay, what about we bring this AI to university for students to um, tickling with that? So we start with this fund to... I can see that the fund is pretty much nearly 30% of the total fund. I can see that pretty a lot. And I read all the comments. I read um, pretty much everything, include positive, negative, and question mark uh, everywhere. So um, what we try to del deliver is we try to help as much as we can based on the current team that we have and based on the team, uh, whatever that we have in three languages at the moment. Um, as I mentioned, that's in, in uh, Indonesia, Japan, and Vietnamese uh, for next generation, which is the singularity net. And um, how we do that would be the next one. But the main point here is we don't go into the show. We can't, we're not going, normally we don't, I'm not sure what other towers are doing or other community doing, but we don't talk about crypto nor the price. We talk about how to write a proposal, how to use an AI, how to leverage an AI going to with a blockchain. And in my cell, I'm going to private blockchain, include public blockchain as well, include AI. So I think that is the advantage of our group over three countries. So, and the final one, that's pretty much, that's what we have. So how we doing that is, as I uh, explained just above, that how we do that is the place where we are sharing for our community. And because we have a trust base in three countries at the moment, as well as in overall uh, Cardano, and uh, as well as the we have the first fund, uh, one of our members were funded in uh, round number two. So this is, we come back and we hope that we can leverage it up and hopefully we can put them together because when we go now, we talk to university, they love to talk about AI more than uh, just uh, just a blockchain. So that is the how we help, uh, how we got to put, we use this as the, a platform to push it out, the AI in, in uh, Eastern Hemisphere and start with the Japan, Vietnam and, and Indonesia. And that is how we got to do that. So I can see a, a fair bit number of uh, common as how we're going to do it because there is some some question asked really interesting about how are you approaching university? Yes, we have a connection. We have a university blockchain alliance. Uh, we form them. We form them with a trust source. We form them with a proper channel. Um, of course, uh, some people may dig in into what about legalization? Yes, it is legalization in some form. We we only present in terms of we sharing knowledge as well as the AI only. So that is something that the university and us work together. So that's pretty much how we got to do with that. And at the end of the day, we wish to have more proposal work on the singularity net from next four months if we get fund. So that's it for us. Thank you. And that's our team. Appreciate that.